Meanwhile, the city of Flint has been granted an extra 24 hours to make a decision on where its drinking water is going to come from. Steve Garagiola is live with a look at why the extension was granted in the first place. Steve? Well, the battle for clean water in Flint has continued to take unusual and interesting twists and turns. A federal judge has even threatened to put council members in jail if they don't agree to the negotiated plan or come up with concrete ideas of a better plan. But they want more time, and now that judge has backed off. Both Governor Snyder and Flint Mayor Karen Weaver support the city entering a 30-year deal with Detroit-based Great Lakes Water Authority to supply water for the city of Flint. This recommendation that we put forward is really based on public health and what's best for the people of Flint and not having to go through another switch. Flint City Council has balked, asking for more time to get expert opinions on the best water option. Today, Flint Councilman Scott Kincaid says don't blame City Council for this delay. Because the City Council has requested the uh, City Attorney's Office to enter into a contract with an uh, independent uh, company to do an analysis. And to this day, right now, as we're talking, the City Attorney's Office has refused to sign off on that contract. A judge set today as the deadline for Flint City Council to agree with the plan or suggest alternatives. Council asked for an extension. This afternoon, Judge David Lawson granted 24 hours in order to hear from the Michigan Department of Environmental Quality and the city of Flint. Today, Governor Snyder says he's not getting involved in this squabble. I think the federal judge has made that clear, so I'm not going to comment more other than the fact that it's before a federal judge, and he's been um, quite thoughtful and aggressive about saying, let's get something done. There is a Flint City Council meeting scheduled for tonight. No action is expected from Council uh, on this issue. Reporting live, I'm Steve Garagiola, Local 4.